So can you describe a few of the things that you do differently than other farmers? <laughs> Make money. <laughs> so, um, That's really important. <laughs> right. Um, and, and it's serious. We, you know, I don't. I think eighty percent of Australian farmers have an off-farm income as well. And in our, at the end of our second year, we turned our first profit because we kind of followed Salatin's advice. You know, we took control of the supply chain. We sell everything directly. Um, we do everything ourselves. I mean, we do everything ourselves. We could really use some help sometimes, but trying to bring the kids on board. Um, I think all farmers do everything themselves for the most part, to be honest. That's, I don't think we're unique in that. Um, I don't know. I suspect maybe more business planning as well, more thinking about, and doing that in that holistic management way where if you're making... If you're making decisions about what's the right size herd, you know you run your business modeling one about how much do you, how many do you need to run to make money and survive, pay all your bills. But then alongside that spreadsheet is the walking the paddocks and watching how the paddocks are performing season after season, and saying, well, we were modeling for 10, 14, or 16 sows, and we're at 12, and this is it, this looks perfect. And our, the business side says we can make money with that. And the ecological health says, you're doing a good job by the land by that. So that's the sweet spot. We stop there. So I don't think that we're unique, but I think in the holistic management system, um, those of us who are following that kind of philosophy are thinking a lot about business concerns alongside ecological and ethical concerns and not preferencing the economics over the ethics. Which is really important when we're looking at, it. I guess, the farmer suicide rates and the farmers that are actually exiting the industry is growing any types of food in Australia, which is a pretty big concern. It's a huge concern. And we should be helping them, you know, make a living like we are. <laughs>